don't think we've got much through this park. We have to go over there. A nice fountain. This is the Ada Lewis trough. This is some drinking trough, isn't it? No, I think it's all right. See, it's moving. So it can't be that bad. We're just waiting to go into the lock. Which, according to the guidebook, is the largest lock on the Thames. I don't know whether that means largest as in deepest or longest. leaving the road behind. That's a really nice little ball. Now it's cooled off a bit, now we're in the woods. See, it's not going to rain, they're all stood up. Suddenly they'll sink their knees. <laughs> Going through the 11th century church of Cookham to back, go back onto the Thames, which is over there. Pretty pretty. Through the churchyard. And back to the Thames. A little detour through Cookham. This is nice and open, isn't it? Some really, really nice houses on this stretch. Nice price, I should imagine, as well. See, this is the last wetland. Doesn't look yeah. very wet, does it? No. Maybe it is wet when it floods. But if we don't get to move on, it will be wet because we'll get hit by that very heavy shower that's coming this way. Just a single track, isn't it? Yes. Used to go all the way to... Um, Hi Wickham. Now it stops at Moulton, does it? No, it goes to it goes to uh, Marlow. That's all. Ducks are unusual ducks. Uh, I don't know. They are not your average mallard, are they? The posh dogs. The ducks that befit the area. That's not a steam one, Robbie. No, it's just a normal little, little teeny tiny branch line train. 
See, it's high speed. That's the one we'll be getting back. Well, the rain doesn't seem to bother the geese. Ooh, ooh, trouble. Not long to go till the finish and the pub. Here comes the rain. Somewhere down here is the end and a pub. And we finish at the pub.